Easy. Oh, I wanted the burial blade to finish him. No one can stand before my blade. Nobody! Except Richard. Cause uh he's all hyped up on demon juice right now. Am I actually going the right way to this thing? Wait a minute, did the paths link up? I think the paths linked up at some point. Huh. Actually should be using a shockwave slash when there's like three in a row like that. It works better. When it's just you though, you get the ruinous bloom and the lightning strike, whichever one I feel more like at the moment. Ruinous bloom takes uh, three of my uh, CC, whereas, in case you haven't noticed, Whereas, um, Lightning Strike only takes two. That's why I usually end up, because I'm normally at eight, so I get, like, a root, two Ruinous Bloom hits, which is this combo. That's one Ruinous Bloom. The second strike is a secondary. Uh, is... Okay, Sophie is getting her up. I was about to say, is someone getting up Sharia? Because someone needs to get her up. Come on, what you got? You got nothing, that's what. Can someone heal me, by the way? I've just realized my... Okay, never mind. You guys took care of it. Thanks, guys. I can't say that I didn't see this coming. I kind of saw it coming, too. But anyways, I think the paths linked up, because I went a different way than the way we got there, but this is definitely the same path. Yeah, there's the chest I opened on the way up in the, like, two or three episodes ago. So the paths definitely linked up, so we still haven't found the right branch in the road. I assume it's going to be around here somewhere. Ah, I bet this is going to tell me which way to go. Fendel Research Laboratory to the left. Well, I know which way we're going. This is where the cross in the road is. It was a lot closer to a Zavhurt like I originally thought it would be. This is a discovery, if I've ever seen one. Radishes. Look at all these random uh, vegetables and fruit we're running into. What? No skit! No skit! We always get skits after discoveries. The, the chain has been broken. No! What the heck? Did I run into an enemy? I was so confused. I guess I ran into an enemy and didn't realize it. Yeah, come on. All of you come on over here. Please. Please. Prepare to get rectified. Can you just die? You die. Ah, thank you. Ow. 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 Don't do that. Come here, you. I have a bunch of lightning attacks with your name on all of them. There we go. Give me some CC. Get ruinous bloomed, son. Why is Sharia down again? Sharia, stop going down. Also, thanks to uh, Sophie, who I assume healed me because Sharia's down, so she couldn't. Oh, cool. Sharia's back up. Sharia, try not to go down again, please. Time for the ruinous bloom of victory. Nah, 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 nah. We aren't playing your Elephrate. I think we saw that one before, but I couldn't remember. I'm pretty sure we did. I found the laboratory, guys. Elith. Uh, I'll leave that. I'm not taking 18 things of Elith. There's no reason. I'm definitely saving the game. Because I do not want to deal with that stupid boss boar ever again in my life. I had to use my all divide on that stupid thing to ensure the win at the end. I could, I probably would have lost if I hadn't used the all divide when I did. This is no time for their dilly dallying. We need to hurry. Hmm? Where is everyone? Did they get lost? Damn it! This is precisely why I hate traveling with them. Asbel, Sophie, Sharia, Pascal, Captain Malik. Wait. Did something happen to them? I can't go on like this. I have to find them. Hello? Little bro, where are you? Pascal? Pascal? Hey, little bro, don't run off like that. <sighs> Yikes. Didn't I tell you it was dangerous to run around on the snow? Well then, perhaps next time you could mention it sooner. But never mind. What about the others? Did you find any of them? Find them? Wait a minute. Isn't that my line, little bro? Huh? By the time we realized it, you were gone. We've been looking everywhere. What are you talking about? That makes no sense. I was right in front of you. Yeah, but you were totally walking in the wrong direction. I don't think that's true. Ah, oh, don't sweat it. Everybody gets lost at some point. Now, let's get back to our friends. March! <laughs> Oh, Hubert, what are, what are, the, how did these turtles function? I don't understand your existence. You make no sense to me, and therefore I hate you. That was probably a little intense, but whatever. Let's go into the laboratory. Doesn't this look inviting? 
I had no idea Fourier's laboratory would be so huge. Fourier, I'm gonna forget how to pronounce that too, and people are gonna get upset with me for it. That's my sister for you. Pascal, what is she like? My sis? Well, she's a year older than me and totally smart. She's accomplished all kinds of stuff. I guess she's my idol. I used to run around and copy whatever she did. So anyway, I'm sure she'll understand when we explain what's going on. Could the Valkanist be inside this laboratory? That would be awesome, huh? But yeah, I don't know. Right now, we should just try and find Fourier. Sounds like a plan. Somehow I doubt she's gonna agree with us on the whole, on the whole uh, not messing with the Valkanist thing. We spent a long time here in Fendel, and yet we're still not any closer to finding the Valkanis. Please keep such negativity in check. It's detrimental to group morale. I understand. I just feel like Richard is suffering while we're running around in circles. Richard is suffering? I cannot even begin to fathom what you're talking about. There has to be some reason Richard's acting the way that he is. I know this isn't what he wanted. I care not for his reasons. If King Richard does not put a stop to his current behavior, then I will be left with no choice but to kill him myself. Hubert! No. I refuse to think like that. If that's your position, then I'll just prove to you that I can stop him. However this ends, I fear the sin will be mine alone to bear. My brother lacks the temperament to kill a friend. Really, really glad you talked to yourself there for a little bit, Hubert, so I would understand what you're thinking. And so that the title of the skit would make sense. Also, the front door is apparently open to the super research facility. That seems like a very big flaw in design, IMO. You should probably have the doors locked. Or, like, key cards or something. I don't know. What is that? There it is. The emergency elevator doesn't seem to be working. Oh, well, that's unfortunate. It'll probably come into effect at some point during this journey. I doubt it's there just for good looks. Oh, okay. So, I thought something would happen there, but nah. Oh, cool. I can go in here. That's good. I found a door that works. Awesome. Opening gate. Insufficient power. Please complete the energy circuit. Oh, joy. That was the easiest energy circuit of my life. What? I... <laughs> I'm not even going to begin to talk about this whole energy circuit and the setup of this laboratory. Can I press X on this? Thank you. Ooh, fancy. The gate is the gate is open. I, I appreciate it. Are you talking about this gate? Ah, it is. Thank you. Why why is there a B in here? Like what? Why? <laughs> Wasp B, whatever you want to call it. Flying bug freak of nature. That's my preferred. Leave me alone. It's definitely a Wasmon from Digimon. Can confirm. Where are you, Fourier? If that is how you pronounce your name. Where may you be? Where may you... Why are there no, like, scientists or Fendelian guards in here at all? Like, <laughs> it's just a bunch of random wasps. Great, I gotta complete another one of these. Uh, this one goes up, doesn't it? Yes. And then this one goes up as well. Easy. Easiest, second easiest energy circuit of my life. That one was slightly more difficult than the last one. Open up my gate. Thank you, random circuit thing. I appreciate your, uh, your effort in helping me with this journey. I still have no idea what is going on. So is the Valkanis Creus, like, really deep underground? Because we keep going down, never up. What's this piece of paper? I can't read that piece of paper? That sucks. What does this door say? That, this door, like, has a marking on it. I don't think the others had that marking on it, that little blue plaque. Ooh! The star anklet. Don't mind if I do. I believe those are for Sophie, if I am not mistaken. Indeed it is. Uh, moon is better, but star is better than moon. Ah, oh, but that gives the casting speed up when you're near death. That would be really nice, actually. I'm gonna put that on her. Really nice indeed. 
All right, then. Stupid wasp. Get lost. I ain't got time for your shenanigans. Okay, maybe they all had these little plaques on them. For some reason, I thought they didn't, but now this door has it as well. What? Oh, my goodness. I don't want to fight it. Ah, an all divide. Yes, that replaces the one I had to use against the boar. So now we have another all divide if we run into some another boar-like boss. If we get into a lot more trouble, we've got that to fall back on. Very good. I like having at least one all divide on a uh, person at all times. The more all divides you can get, the better. I am going to go right first. I was thinking go down first, but no, nah, we're going right first. Dude, leave, leave me alone. What is with all of this wildlife? Where is Fourier or like any other kind of Fendelian? Oh my goodness, why? Platinum scabbard, ooh. Don't I already have a platinum one? I think I do. Do I not already have? No, I have gold. I don't have platinum. Platinum is a lot better, though. And it gives me an attack and defense buff of plus 12 as an effect rather than inorganic resistance. Stagger time down. That's actually pretty nice. But that's only at near death, so I'd rather have that. All right. Oh, no, wait. No, 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 no. Skit, Skit. Is Skit still here? Yes. That new sheath looks really cool. I've wanted this ever since I joined the Night Academy. Temper your enthusiasm. Why? Those who rely too heavily on equipment neglect to hone themselves. Wait, wouldn't having equipment you love make you want to work that much harder? In the old days, swordsmen became legend without touching that sort of thing. But times have changed. Now the equipment does all the work, and any old half-wit can wield it. Here we go. <laughs> Gotta listen to Captain Malik talk about the good old days. Actually, kind of curious as to the age of all the characters. Hubert is like 17, right? Because I'm pretty sure Asbel is 18 and Hubert is the younger brother. So he would have to be 18 at the most. Probably a little less. Oh, I've got to go into this room first. My bad. Uh, Sherry, I assume, is around the same age. 16 to 19, somewhere in that area. Sophie is like 11 or 12. Why are these circuits so easy? Oh, this one's actually a little more complicated. you got to put a little more thought into it. You can't push that one up because of where the pipes are. So you've got to move that one out of the way. And then move this one over. And then push that one. So that was a little more complicated, but that was still ridiculously easy. Like, there's no maze type thing or anything like that that I would expect from this kind of stuff. I don't know Malik's age. I can only assume he's like somewhere from 30 to 40, probably closer to 40. Uh, Pascal, I don't know. Uh, Marcians apparently can live very long, or at least the Overseer can, so I can't even take a general guess at Pascal's age. And Richard is around the same age as Asbel. He's like 19, probably. I'd probably say Richard is 19. He seems like he would be a year older than Asbel or something. Similar to that. How, how, like, big is this research facility? And why are there only, like, monsters and robots rather than actual people doing research? These are the questions that I must ask. Is this another chest in here? Yes, indeed. Orange scarf. Nice. Is this, uh, I thought this might be a discovery or something, because it's different from the other stuff we've seen so far, but it's not. How much time have I got? Oh, we still got plenty of time. We're only, like, in the first five minutes of the fourth video of this session, which would be part 58, I think. I think we're in part 58 right now, if I'm not mistaken. It's kind of hard to keep track of all that in the middle of recording. I'm pretty sure this is part 58, though. I could be wrong. Oh, hey, we didn't have to do a circuit this time. That leads me to believe that we are near the end of this uh, research lab. We're at the bottom fourth floor. That's pretty deep. Now we gotta do another circuit to open this door. Ah, see? Now this one is a little more complicated. This is what I look forward to seeing. Actually, never mind. Looking at it again, this is incredibly simple. Ooh, maybe not, actually. Can I get out? No, I can't get out. Okay, never mind. It is really simple. I thought that I wouldn't be able to move through right there. Uh actually can't get in right there. I'll just pull this back. Easy. I thought it might get a little more complicated there for a second, but it turned out to be about as easy as all the other ones. It's just a little more roundabout. Bum, 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 bum. Now I pull this one over, and then I will go around and push it into place. Like, that would have been a good difficulty for the first or the second one, in my opinion, rather than this, like, I think this is the third or the fourth. That would have been a good difficulty for, like, number two. I don't know. Maybe I'm just used to puzzles like that. Those are my kinds of puzzles. Stuff like that. Moving stuff into position and all that jazz. 
yeah, this definitely, that up there definitely looks like where we're supposed to be. So I'm going to check over here first. Actually, no, there's another elevator over here. That might actually be the emergency elevator that takes you all the way back up. Is it? I don't know. I'm not going to get in and see because I'm afraid if I go all the way up, it'll be like, nah, you can't take the emergency elevator back. You got to run all the way back down. Yada, yada. Let's go over here. What have we got in here? Anything? Anything interesting? Oh my goodness, this this place is so big! A busted blade, nice. Could probably dualize that. The door won't open. Alright. So I bet uh, Fourier, is that how you pronounce it? I've already forgotten. I think it's Fourier or something like that. Is going to be over this away in here. This is probably going to take her to us. Unless we still have another floor to go through and another circuit to complete. We are in the bottom fifth floor, and it looks like we are going to still be doing some running. This lab so Ah, save point. That means we made progress. Save over this really quick. Still got plenty of time. We can get some stuff done. Let's go uh, see if we can find Fourier before this session ends. Ah, there is another circuit. I bet she's right past this circuit. So we should just have to finish this one. The monsters in this lab are pretty strange, aren't they? Apparently it's not a circuit in here. We get a cutscene. Sounds good to me. I've heard that Fendel has been investing in biological weaponry. Perhaps this lab is being used to facilitate it. Watch out, guys. This one looks like trouble. I expect ah, cool. We got a boss. Oh my goodness, your health stat. Why? Why is your health stat ever that large? The best from everyone. Oh my goodness, the damage. Did you guys see that? That was insane. I swear, if this thing summons enemies as well, I'm going to be... Probably very upset. Let's go for Ruinous Bloom. Yeah, I like it. No, 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 no. Leave, leave Sherry alone. Of course you got an Elith Break early on in the match. Yeah, just be stunned for all of your Elith Break, please. Yeah, he does some good damage. Come on, you. Take the Ruinous Bloom. He just do a thousand? I think he did a thousand to Hubert. Hubert doesn't have as much defense as I do. Come here, you. Eh. I love Ruinous Bloom. I really do. I like it. It's nice. I think this thing is going to be better going for physical moves than going for my, uh... It's not weak to... It's not weak to either art. I'm going to go for physical probably more than magic. You've already got another Elith Break? Are you serious? You've only lost 6,000 HP. This thing is insane. It's crazy. At least it's not summoning other enemies. And it doesn't have, like, any broken attacks so far from what I've seen. Then again, you know, we haven't been fighting it for very long. It's really fast. That's annoying. Oh my goodness, the combos. Sharia, get away while I get its attention. No, don't go for Sharia. Leave Sharia alone. Here we go. Here we go. Get some damage off. Get some damage off. I really need my, uh... Oh, that was really cool what I just did there. Look at that. Ooh, I like that. I like that combo. That's sweet. Phantom Pulse. Ah, Sharia went down. Sophie, go get a Sharia up. Me and Hubert will fight this thing for now. 